Hey everybody, this is Marcin Super on the Marcin Super Channel, and I have a new Pokemon Wi-Fi battle for you. So I'm kind of recording this right after um, last week's, last Monday's um, Wi-Fi battle, because by the time you're watching this, I'm in the middle of class for my new semester of school. So I kind of wanted to get Monday's video out the way, because I can't, I'm not going to be home, so... Hopefully this week is full of awesome cool things. I should have videos out all week. I uh, don't know what's going on with Wednesday's video at this point because I have not started it yet. But it's going to be a good time for all. Today we are playing another team with another battle with the Mega Midrail team. Um, at this point I feel like Theme Thursday came back. I'm not completely sure. Um... <laughs> If not, do I have the Theme Thursday? Nope. 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 I thought I had Theme Thursday's layout out, but not. Nah, apparently, just had a, just saw a black screen for no reason. So, I'm looking at this team, and it's just wild what we might be fighting today. I'm seeing Mandibuzzes. Um, I'm seeing all types of things, actually. And I just don't know what I'm going to do about it, low-key. Um, let me make sure I take a picture of the team. Um, this is OU. Actually, this is OU. OU mix, so. Because the Sylveon Lucario and the Crocodile is all UU. And everything on the right is OU. Actually, I think there's more UU mons on this team. Then. There might be more UU mons on this team than OU. I think the only solid OU mon is the Charizard, tell you the truth. Send the Ichi as our six. So, I'm seeing the Defog in Mandibuzz. I see probably Rock set up in the Crocodile. If not, it's Choice Scarf. So, it depends what we're seeing. He does start off with Mandibuzz. And me starting off amazing. Not a bad setup right now. Mandibuzz does not have a lot of generic things to deal with me so I can always go off with the knockoff right now um, that will take care of any items that Mandibuzz has on it and it has the leftovers we do see the toxic toxic is a problem but that is okay that is okay to deal with the toxic about a turn or two I'm definitely gonna have to get Actually, I'm just going to get out now. We see the U-turn. And now what baffles me is what is its stab move? Because if it has a decent enough stab move, Beedrill is not the best bet to bring in right now. I don't see any hard counters except for the Charizard to the Beedrill. I'm guessing it's Toxic Defog, Roost, and maybe a a Wind Stab, actually. I'm actually going to sit out Wishy Washy. Um, because I just want to see what he might be going for. We see the knockoff, so I don't have the Chesto set up ready. And knockoff probably declares that that is probably its stab move. Because I only see one fire type on the team. I think Hydro Pump wouldn't be bad. I don't see anything that can hard absorb it. If we do see this, if we do see, no, we see the Crocodile. So if this connects, we're good. If this connects, we're, we, this was a good move. Hydro Pump does connect. Is it enough for a knockout on Crocodile? No, it's not. It is just enough for Crocodile to get <laughs> hammered. So we're going to go for the wireless. Hopefully he switches out. And if we get the rocks out, Crocodile is just going to get knocked out. We see the Sylveon, actually. We see the shiny Sylveon. And we're going to... The wireless is going to connect, too. So that's actually works good in our favor. I'm expecting a choice spec Hyper Voice. 
And I don't have anything that inertially wants to take that as much. I should be faster, so I should be able to get a Hydro Pump off. But we do avoid, we do see the Shadow Ball actually. And looking at, the, oh, that was a crit. So that might actually not even be choice spec. It might not actually even be choice spec. So, do we see a withdrawal here? No, we don't. I'm going to go in with the Hydro Pump. There's a good amount of damage. We see the Moon Blast. So, we do know it's not choice spec at this point. I'm guessing that it's some type of defensive build. I'm guessing it's some type of defensive build, honestly. And what we're going to do is I'm going to send in Beedrill. Beedrill should be able to outspeed Sylveon. I'm guessing that I don't need to Mega Evolve right now because I am, I'm max speed. And I should be able to U-turn out, either knocking out this Sylveon, or at least pivoting out so I'm not trapped. So we do see the withdrawal. We see the Lucario actually, which I'm more than fine with. We're going to get the Beedrill Knight out. We see the Beedrill. I kind of went for the Drill Run, actually, predicting this. But I'd rather just get the U-Turn out. It's not going to do super much. It actually did way more than I expected. Gosh. And since he actually switched out, he loses his turn. So there's a couple things I can go for. I can go for Big Bat. Those start spamming. Hey. No, not HP Ice. I could go amazing and go start shooting off EQs or knockoffs. My Lucario is actually not a bad choice at this pack. And I think my Sylveon is just not a good choice. If his Lucario is like my Lucario, I'm expecting the close combat. Dragon Claw, Ice Beam, Iron Head, Fusion Boat. Amazing got the Intimidation. If it doesn't have Ice Punch, Amazing is actually a good choice. I could have a Classic Samurai Duel. Let's have a Classic Samurai Duel. Because I actually see nothing on the scene that resists a close combat. And I'm faster. So Classic Samurai Duel? I'm going to call that a Classic Samurai Duel. Definitely have to call that a classic samurai duel. That is absolutely a classic samurai duel. <laughs> that was fun. So we see the Charizard played right now. And what I'm hoping for right now, and if this plays out the way I want it, I might actually win. I feel like he would use Mega Charizard X. If not... This is a bad play. Because we would get the Intimidation off. So it's Charizard Y. So this is actually bad for us. Mega Charizard Y has a higher special defense. But it also has hella bad defenses. So are we actually going to see the Fire Blast right now? And it's going to connect. That's going to do way more damage than I expected. So. We're now at a predicament. <laughs> Check moves. Because as long as that sun out, that fire blast is going to be doing massive damage. That hidden power is hidden power ice, I believe. Hyper voice isn't going to do much to Charizard. Side shock is actually not going to do a lot either. If we had the rocks, that'd be a different story. I'm sending Big Bad out. Reason we're sending Big Bad out is because I want to scare out the Charizard. A Fusion Bolt will pre- Actually, a Dragon Claw will hit much more. Ugh. I'm actually going to go for the Fusion Bolt. Maybe he'll stay in. He actually stayed in. He stayed in. Whoa. He actually stayed in. 
And he decides to bring out another flying type. I really hope he switches out to the crocodile. Yeah, he can withdraw to crocodile. So he's now he's now checking to see if I'm scarfed or not. Which is good on his point. He's checking to see if I'm choice scarfed or not. Low breaker does Terravo does not go through type disadvantage. So I'm actually gonna send out Pixion at this point. Because Pixion is just so much better. We see the Dragon Claw and we actually get we actually predict that pretty well. I do forget that Crocodile learns Dragon Claw. But I figured no offensive attack was going to take me down that quick. So we're free to fire. Actually, we're not. Because I think the no, the Lucario's dead. So we are free to shoot off. We're not free to shoot off jack shit. We're not free to do anything in this world. But to shoot off ice beams. <laughs> I'm actually looking at the team, and ice beam actually takes out the rest of the team fairly well. I'm also charged choice scarf. And we do see that Crocodile is not choice scarf. It's prob it's not even choice man to tell you the truth. So I think we might be able to have a clean one right now. I think we might actually be able to No, we still have the Sylveon to deal with. We have Sylveon, Mandibus, and the and the actually I wanna save Beedrill for Superior. And I'm actually gonna save because I feel like if I can get rid of this Sylveon, the rest of this is pretty alright. Ooh, really? Really? We just go take hits like that. I mean, I can't take any more. I honestly can't keep taking more. I could go for the poison jab. Poison jab hits almost everything for neutral. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for the poison jab. That that Sylveon has to be choice spec. That's what I'm guessing. So we still have to do with the mandibus that takes neutral from our grass stabs, our bug stabs. And then we have, yeah, we're just gonna U-turn out. The reason we're gonna U-turn out is because I'm not taking any of this mess. I'd rather fusion boat or ice beam, ice beam's like solid. Even if we take off knock all damage, we just become slower. Which I feel like I'm not gonna need so much anymore. We do see the toxic. I could have stayed in actually. If he just was gonna toxic. So we know it has toxic knockoff. Um uh, probably I feel like it's roosting um roosting default for the other two moves. I'm actually just gonna ice me. From this range, we should be able to knock out. Cool. And then I'm going to stay into Ice Beam because even if, as long as um, Superior doesn't get maybe a plus two on a Hidden Power of Fire, we should be able to deal. Um, I don't know what other moves. I like. I think Superior has Leaf Storm, Hidden Power of Fire. Or it's, it's two big things. So we should be able to knock out at least two hit KO. Even if he does decide to use a leap seed. Big bad four times resists the grass stab. It's not like he's faster. So we did pretty good. I do, I just don't want to switch into the B drill right now for the, the stylish KO. But the for the match was forfeited. So if you guys like this battle, make sure you check it out. It was a two to one, so it was pretty it was a pretty close match. 
If you guys like this type of content, make sure you hit me with a like. If you ain't subscribed, subscribe already. It's the link right there down in the description. Um, try to make sure I have five videos for you guys at least for this week. I don't know with the Rocky school schedule currently, but maybe we'll have some other surprises for you guys too. Make sure you hit this video with a like. I love you. I appreciate you. And this is Mars King Super on the Mars King Super channel. And the Mars is out.